In this video, we will go over a new feature of SKUGrid that allows you to use algorithmic repricing to allow you to maintain pricing that is competitive but profitable as well. Once you are logged into SKUGrid, go to Settings. Click on Marketplaces. Click on eBay or Amazon, depending on the marketplace that you're selling on. Click on the country that you are listing in. Scroll down to where it says Buy Box Owner. These are your algorithmic repricing settings. The first option you will see is Use Buy Box Algorithm on All Items. It's a yes or no as far as do you want to apply algorithmic repricing to all items or do you want to be able to turn it on individually per item as needed. Select yes or no here. Next is Include Shipping Costs and Algorithm. Select yes if you want to include both supplier and competitor shipping costs in, al in the algorithm when SKUGRID is creating your prices. Choose no if you don't. Next you have how often price should be checked. This is how often the competition is checked. SKUGRID's repricing does not depend on this. SKUGRID will be looking at the lowest price competitor for the identical item. The next field says what is the maximum margin you want to have. Enter the dollar amount that you would like to have as a maximum for your profits as a general rule for all items. The next option is by how much do you want to undercut the competitor's price. Enter the amount you'd like to undercut by. Example, if the main competitor is listed at $99.99 and you have it set to undercut by $0.05, cents, then your item would be priced at $99.94 as long as you're still profitable. So enter whatever number you're comfortable with. The last option for algorithmic repricing is use maximum price if we're unable to beat the competitor. This means that based upon the maximum margin you set, if SKUGRID determines that it cannot undercut the competition because you will no longer be profitable, if you set this to yes, SKUGRID will use your maximum margin that you previously set to create your selling price. Choose yes or no here as to whether or not you want to use this function. Once you are done with configuring the buy box owner settings, scroll down and save the settings. If you are applying the buy box owner settings to all items, then you will want to then go to the My Items tab and click Batch Options, force all items to reprice to get the items checked and repriced with the new settings. To apply the buy box owner algorithmic repricing to individual items, you would need to go to your My Items tab. Locate the item you want to apply the buy box owner settings to and click edit. Scroll down to the bottom and see the option that says use buy box owner algorithm on this item. Make sure to configure buy box owner settings before enabling. Select yes if you want the buy box owner algorithmic repricing to apply to this particular item. Click update item. Once you return to the grid, locate the item and click force reprice. The algorithmic repricing would then be applied to that item once it is checked and repriced. Please note, you can also apply buy box owner settings when adding an individual item to the grid using the same method. Also note, using the algorithmic repricing will result in extra credit usage for checking on your competition. Lastly, for those that are selling on Amazon, there is one additional buy box owner setting. If you navigate to settings, Click on Marketplaces, click on Amazon, click on the country you're selling in, scroll down to the Buy Box Owner settings. You'll see that all of the options are the same as for eBay sellers with the exception that there is one more option called Beat Only Competition In. Here you have the ability to select Buy Box, FBA, or All. If you choose Buy Box, then SKUGRID will be considering the current price of the Buy Box as your main competitor. If you choose FBA, SKUGRID will be considering the lowest price seller that is under Amazon Fulfillment and use that particular seller as the basis of your competition. If the, if the option is set for all, then SKUGRID will use the lowest price seller regardless of if they are in the buy box or not, or if they are Amazon Fulfilled or third party merchant. It will be the cheapest seller that will be considered your competition. Thank you for watching this video. We hope that you found it helpful. We'll see you in the next video.